Hello, piggy people, and happy guinea pig appreciation day. I know we appreciate our guinea pigs every day, but maybe we should give them some extra cuddles today. So, in honor of guinea pig appreciation day, I thought I would take the opportunity to tell you guys how I started out on YouTube. So if you are new here, I usually make videos one to two times a week. My name is Abby, otherwise known as Skinny Pigs One. So I started a YouTube channel back in August of 2010. Isn't that crazy? So I originally started YouTube, I just wanted to have a place to store my memories. So when I started owning guinea pigs, I only had male skinny pigs. I used to take a lot of video clips just because they were adorable and I thought where could I store these so that I can watch them over and over or share them with some friends. So I thought oh YouTube will be a great place to put that. So I uploaded a couple videos and during this time I was also on some guinea pig forums. So I would share some links on there just for people who were interested to see the piggies in action. And from there, I got views from people who were on the forum, but also some other people. And people started asking questions. So like, what do you feed your guinea pigs? What kind of cage is that? What care do you need to give for a skinny pig, etc. And I kind of realized that, oh, maybe there's not a lot of information available to people about how to properly care for guinea pigs. So in the beginning, I'll admit, I was not doing the most proper care. I didn't understand that there's all different types of pellets, some being really crappy and others being good. Uh, same for pet store treats. I had a couple of the treats that were absolute garbage that I would never touch now. So I just thought, okay, I'm going to learn more, research more, and I'm going to share what I learn with other people because there seems to be a need for this. So as I shared more information, as I figured it out and learned for myself, uh, more and more people came to my channel looking for advice or help or just inspiration. So that's really how I got started. And it's been an amazing time over the last 11 years on YouTube. It's definitely changed. YouTube has changed since when I first started. When I first started, um, it was mostly younger people who were sharing about guinea pigs, like I'm talking like 13, 14 year olds, and then myself who was an adult. And now it's really changed to there's a lot more adult channels showing proper guinea pig care, which I think is absolutely awesome. And of course, camera quality sure has changed over the years and content. It's been a really awesome ride and I appreciate everybody who has stuck around and still continues to watch my channel because I still love to share things. Even though I don't think my videos get nearly as far as they used to, I still enjoy all of you faithful followers and it is just nice to every once in a while get comments where people are like, oh my goodness, thanks for this, that saved my guinea pig's life, I didn't know about gas drops or I didn't know how to hand feed or I wasn't sure how to give a medication. You know, all of those things, even just one comment a day where it helps somebody is so worth it. And I know like many of you, you enjoy following the piggies that I have, knowing how they're doing. And I just like to share some tips and tricks along the way. So thanks guys, and let me know down in the comments below when did you find my channel? Was it recently or have you been here near the beginning? It would just be very interesting to know. Bye guys!
If you like watching guinea pig videos, learning how to care for us, seeing product hauls or reviews, or really anything else guinea pig, please subscribe and make sure you hit that notification bell so you never miss a video. Down below I've left two more videos for you to pick from, so keep on watching!